Hello, Mioni here, and welcome back to another video. This time we're inside the Gold Saucer, and that's because we're going to be taking part in The Slice is Right. This is the brand new gate event added in the 5.1 series. We're essentially inside the Gold Saucer every 40 minutes to the hour. We can take part in this event on the big round stage here. Essentially, this is to do with Yojimbo, and Yojimbo will spawn in here and will periodically slice away at bamboo, sort of fruit ninja style, and you have to avoid that bamboo falling onto you. So there are circle AoEs and line AoEs, as you might imagine. The inspiration for this, and indeed the technology for this, very likely came from the second boss of that Rabanasta Alliance raid, part of the Ivalis series. And I think if you've done that content, you will know exactly what I mean. Essentially, more MGP is rewarded for the longer that you actually last on here. If you do get hit by an AoE, it sends you straight out of the arena, and essentially you get whatever MGP you've managed to accure in that time. Now there are certain different stages of this. The first is very clearly just avoiding bamboo. The second stage is where Daigoro, i.e. Yojimbo's pet dog, will actually spawn and so will lots of other piles of MGP around the arena. These MGP piles actually give you 1000 MGP. That's not a fake MGP, That's that will give you a thousand MGP for every single pile that you as a player loot. So essentially the goal is do you risk looting those MGP piles? Because if Daigoro manages to jump onto one of these randomly and you're there, you will also be thrown out of the arena. Essentially the same premise that if you're in Daigoro's way, you will be thrown out of the way as well, regardless of if there's a pile or not, as you can see here. So a lot of people actually uh, got thrown out of the arena, as you can see in this footage. I fortunately didn't risk the last couple of MGP piles, although I did manage to get 1000 MGP bonus from that. There are numerous stages, and ultimately as far as I got, there is actually an extra stage I wasn't able to record, which you may remember if you've seen the live letter recently with Yoshi P, which was the pre 5.1 live letter, demonstrated the last stage where Yojimbo will hide MGP under a cup and move them around. It's sort of like guess the cup minigame and that's pretty much that final stage. It's quite an amazing source of MGP even if you do quite poorly as I've done here. Even though I was the last to be thrown off due to a line attack. Three, three to four thousand MGP just for standing around which doesn't seem like that much especially when you can get you know a solid 4k just for shooting things on the Air Force One minigame or the Leap of Faith gives you about 4,000 as well. It is definitely up there, as that's sort of like what you will get if you're bad at this minigame. Ultimately, I would imagine you could get probably 8,000 to like 9,000 MGP or something if you were really good at it, looted all of the piles, or looted some of them at least, and managed to make it all the way to the end. It could be quite a profitable thing. It does also say on the Wikipedia page for this content that essentially if you do survive all the way to the end, the final price is 5,000 MGP, as well as whatever else you've managed to get from all of the bonus rounds, which is quite a good accumulation. And if you see this event up, you should definitely take part in it, as every bit of MGP counts if you're saving towards a mount. I personally think this is fantastic. It's a bit of a shame that we uh, sort of lost skin change we can believe in. That's no longer in the game, unfortunately. I would prefer it if they kept all of the games in the actual gold saucer and just rotate it through them more frequently but apparently that's not the case and uh, a lot of them have been lost to time including now skin change we can believe in i suppose it wasn't the best mini game but um, and this is certainly a, a better replacement for it but it's definitely a sad day for those of you who enjoyed it either way let me know if you've managed to get to the last stage yet and uh, how much rng you've had with uh, the various pillars falling on you and i'll see you all next time now just to wait another 40 minutes, I've totally got this.